Dearly beloved, I want to bless you in the matchless mighty name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. It's a wonderful day and uh, I want to bring a word to you so that you will be encouraged, especially our young people, because these are the days when our people, or especially our young people are seeking an identity in the midst of a bigger crowd. They want to be known, they want to be seen or rather be set apart in the world. But I want to caution you people about one thing. What is needed in this very last days is something crucial and that is God. And especially when I mention God, it is the Lord Jesus Christ. We need to be taught in the love of God. We need to be embedded in the word of God. And this is super important in our lives, especially in these last days where the world and its offerings are so welcoming to our young people that they tend to fall into it. You can have an identity in the society, in the world that you are living. But I want to let you know, have an identity in God. You need to be not just taught by the world. You need not just be taught by the circumstances surrounding your situations. I want to bring a word to you in Isaiah 54 verse 13, which says, Your children shall be taught by the Lord. Children have to be taught in the word of God. Children have to be governed by God's word. And I want to let you know something that when you are led by God, you possess a peace that is not given by anyone else but a divine peace that comes and given to you by our God. And today, instead of seeking an identity and a highness in the uh, social platforms and in the world, I would rather encourage you to seek an identity in the Lord. Why? Because when God identifies you as one person who is surrendering yourself to the word of God and wants to accomplish everything through God, I am letting you know that your life will be so supernaturally led by God. And when he presents you with the power of the Holy Spirit, you become a supernatural young man, young woman. I want you to ponder about what I've said. Let the Lord take over your life. Your future is in the hands of the Lord. Bless you all.